Hi guys, Matt Thomas here at Cedar Rock Studio Guitar Gallery in Indiana. And today we've got a beautiful McPherson for you. This is actually the CMG 4.0. So it's actually a 15 inch across guitar and four inches deep. Uh, and it's quite comfortable. Um, now this one features a really, really beautiful Engelman spruce top tons of silking throughout the top and as you can see the sound holes are over here that allows them to do their own very specific top bracing which is incredibly punchy and fast now look at this gorgeous set of granadillo back and sides now what i thought was really lovely is they chose to do this flamed koa binding all the way around which is very similar in color to this particular set of granadillo and also on the heel cap it's koa even though it blends right in it's a uh, it's that figured koa now these were custom ordered as wide spec so it's got a ebony bridge here that is two and five sixteenths and a wide spec knot that is one and 25 30 seconds now it is an ebony fingerboard with an african mahogany neck that is koa bound with some really really bold um what look like maple fret dots but they did a whole black circle around them that way so that they really stand out apart from this figured koa binding sometimes you can get lost in that but i think that that black with the maple really sets it apart so that you can see where you're going on this fretboard now another thing i want to note is this is actually a positive angle and cantilevered neck and fretboard so it actually doesn't touch the top here and they intentionally build them if you hold it like that, it looks straight. But one of the ways that they achieve that is the back is thinner than the upper bout. So it gets thinner as you get to the bottom. Now, it does have a slight V profile to the neck shape here into this really lovely black veneer cap on the back here. Um, and it's also got a... Um, ebony head cap here with their McPherson logo and some beautiful gold Goto 510s with ebony buttons. Now this was one of my first experiences with one of the wooden McPhersons. I played several of the carbon fiber ones and really loved them, but man, it's quite interesting how fast the attack is. Now the other thing that's really lovely is it does come with the Anthem pickup already installed and they have a feedback buster that is custom fit for their specific sound hole. Which this location is wonderful because as the player you get more of that volume of the guitar. Now if you've got any other further questions about this lovely McPherson CMG 4.0, message Alan at cedarrockstudio.com and thanks for listening.